Hi guys, so today I am doing my February favorites. I know this is kind of late, but I really wanted it to get up so I wouldn't miss out on a month. Um, the first favorite I have to mention is my bronzer that I've been using a lot this month. It is the Bourjois Chocolate Bronzer and it's in the shade 52. This is the packaging. We only had a shade 51 in Iceland and it was a bit too light. So when I went to London last year I got the shade 52 which is a perfect bronze shade. It does have tiny hints of shimmer in it but it doesn't really transfer onto the skin. It says uh, filled with glints of sunshine but you know to me it's sort of a mad bronzer. I do use it to kind of contour. I do like the hula bronzer more for that but this definitely does the job and I've really been loving it with this brush. It's the Bobbi Brown Face Blender. It's just a short handled travel brush. Um, my mom actually had this and I kind of just stole it from her. But I really like it because it fits kind of nicely onto the cheeks. I can't understand how girls can do bronzer with those huge fluffy brushes. I don't like bronzer all over my face. I like it kind of just where the sun with natural hair kind of to contour. So I like these smaller types of brushes. And also along these lines, kind of like summery bronze type of skin. I've been loving my highlighter from MAC. This one is actually limited edition so I hate mentioning this but I've just been loving it. It is the MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Champagne and the shade is just absolutely gorgeous. It's not too silvery, it's not too gold. It's just kind of a champagne color bronze. So another favorite of mine, um, as for eyeshadows, I've just realized that every time I have done my eyeshadow looks this month, I've been really reaching for the Naked 2 palette. I go kind of back and forth with this one. I Sometimes I love the shades in this and sometimes I, I don't think they're too warm for my skin tone. Um, sometimes I wish I had the Naked 1 too, which I don't see. You've probably all seen this a billion times. But um, I've especially been loving Health Baked um, Chopper Tees, the kind of lighter shades in this palette. But as for lip products, I've been really loving just kind of brownie nudes, um, nothing too crazy. I've not been reaching for any bright colors or any like deep dark colors. I don't know why, I've just been loving my nudes. So I got this lipstick from my grandmother the other day. It's the Estee Lauder Pure Color um, Creme Lipstick in Rose Tea. And this is the shade. It's kind of like a rosy nude. It's kind of a dark brown, but I really like it. It goes on nice, it's smooth, it's moisturizing. And for lip gloss, I've just, <sighs> I'm head over heels for this lip gloss. Um, I'm showing this in an upcoming haul, but this is the NYX Butter Gloss in Creme Brulee. I really want to get like all the colors or at least all the wearable um, basic colors. I've just been really, really loving this. I don't think it's the most pigmented lip gloss out there. I don't think it's like has a pigment of a lipstick, at least not like this color. There might be like the darker colors might be a lot more pigmented, but the application, the consistency and everything, it's just flawless mm. and, it really and it smells really good, it smells like cake and I am personally really sensitive to those kind of scents but this one I really do enjoy so if you haven't uh, picked these up, which I highly doubt because these have been so popular um, definitely give it a go, it's just like so smooth and buttery I just, I can't really describe it any better than they do um, if you live in Iceland, you can buy the next products. There's a store in Copenhagen which sells them. They're not and the last favorite of mine, I'm not including any fashion favorites or anything, just because I couldn't really think of anything that I've been loving this month more than other. So, so the last favorite of mine has to be this perfume. It's the Boss Orange Auto Toilet, I believe. Yep. Um, and I'm completely running out. You can see just a tiny little bit of fluid. On the bottom but I'm just kind of trying to finish this I do really enjoy the scent mm. and if you're looking for a cologne for a guy the boss orange cologne is absolutely amazing it's like so that was it I really hope that you enjoyed my February favorites I hope you have a great March I am 
just been really busy in this beginning of March. My boyfriend had his birthday on the 3rd and school has been crazy and I've been working and it's just a lot going on. So this is why um, this video had to go up this late but I still hope you enjoy it and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye!